and he didn't punish them for the weak coverage there, but they can't count on him to continue missing. Inside, and down it goes, jamming that one home. Yeah, the vision's one thing, but the timing also helps. Lillard prepared to get the ball to his teammate. And the Grizzlies call their first time out of the game. Well, we talk about the clutch scoring of Damian Lillard. I'll put it in black and white. Since he entered the league in 2012, nobody has more makes in the last 20 seconds of a game to tie or go ahead. Nobody. Looking at who's out there now for the Grizzlies. Jackson, he's checked in for Steven Adams. Dylan Brooks comes in for Clark. Baines checked in for John Crenshaw. And it's John Morant in for DeAnthony Melton. And they're getting their points now almost exclusively from the triple. Four of their last five makes are from beyond the arc. And the list of players with multiple series clinching buzzer beaters in the playoffs. Michael Jordan and Damian Lillard. And with a little Bon Voyage wave of the hand, for good measure, Dame time is as real as it gets. Man, the triples keep falling, guys. That's three in a row. Kicks to Lillard. One twenty-two left now here in the second. Knocks it loose. Stolen by Jackson. Three on three. Morant right side. The three. Rebound by the Trailblazers. And we haven't seen them be quite as aggressive driving the basketball, settling far too much for jumpers. And what a huge performance for him. I mean, he drained three three-pointers in that first quarter, and he's got two more here in the second. And the call will be against Yusuf Nurkash. That is his first foul of the game. Blazers substitution. Drew Eubanks, Justice Winston. Here's Moran. Fouled in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway, so a three-point play chance for him. Sweet to be a difference maker in the game, and he's been a great option for them on these possessions. The Grizzlies shooting their fifth attempt at the line in the game. At the line for Memphis. John. And really a good job of getting to the line in that first quarter. Hasn't been doing that as much here in the second. Simons, the pass to Eubanks. Little, again, the Trailblazers score. And despite the hot start from beyond, they've gotten away from shooting the triple. The three from Morant. Nailed from three-point land. Morant's got a couple of three-pointers in the second for the Grizzlies. Simons, the pass to Little. Pass to Winslow. It's good. He makes his first shot of the game. I'd like to see Justice Winslow doing great work on the interior like that. Unable to get the ball in bounds. They get called for the five-second violation. Well, aside from that possession, they've done a pretty good job of keeping the turnovers way down this game. And the Grizzlies making a change here. Adams checked in. Here's Simons. He's got 15 from 12 feet out. Good and the nice assist from Winslow. Winslow's got three assists in the game. That'll be a five-second call. Portland's ball. Twenty seconds left in the first half. Here's Eubanks. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. And here's Winslow. Pass to Simon. And he gets it to go, hitting off the back of the rim. And now just a four-point Grizzly lead. They're going to turn it over. They couldn't get it in bounds that time. Trail Blazers ball. Blazers substitution. Ben McEnroe.
Here's Simon. Javita caught. Count it. He caught it. That's how you do it. Stay patient, wait for the opportunity, and boom. That's exactly how you want to close out the quarter, too, with some confidence. John Moran has been leading the charge, guys, for the Memphis Grizzlies. He ends up propping in two from distance, making a difference from long range in this one. We've got more NBA basketball coming your way in just a minute. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. There was no stopping John Morant in the first half. He ended up with 39 points, two block shots, and one rebound. And last game, he could never really get going. Maybe that lit a fire under him tonight. Kenny, what do you think about the Grizzlies? The bench unit was an essential part of the puzzle in the first half. They really stepped it up in a big way, and that helped out. And now the starters can appreciate not having to carry the load on their own. Shaq, how do you think Portland played? Defensively, they got to do a better job of staying connected to the shoot. Better to crowd those guys, force them to put the ball on the floor and make a play. And after a fairly even first couple of quarters, the second half could turn out to be a great one as both teams try to gain an edge. Guys, John Morant has been sensational. Well, through the first two, he has been nothing short of a marksman from deep. Yeah, you would hope the defense at least would start to consider creeping up on him just a little bit. And we've got second half action for you. Thus far, a pretty evenly contested game. That'll be a five-second call. Yikes, that one stings there. Hurts so much more to turn the ball over, especially with how tight the game is. How about that mobile one block we just saw? Amazing defensive work. And, and guys, they'll think twice about attempting that shot again. That was a big-time rejection. And here are the Trailblazers now. Here's Simons. That misses had a chance to tie it there. That's a surprise. I mean, really out of character for him to miss when the defense is not right up on it. And that's going to be a turnover. They call him for eight seconds. Yeah, just one turnover in the first half, but it's been a different story here in the second half. He is not doing a good job of keeping the ball in his mitts. On the floor for Portland. You've got Yusuf Jurkic. Hart is out there with Damian Lillard. And it's Simons in at the shooting guard. Bottom line, you need shooters on your team who can space the floor. Oh, there's no doubt he's a legitimate threat from downtown, and he's demonstrating that in this game. And that's a couple of very shaky possessions in a row. One turnover right after the other. And here are the Trailblazers now. It's a one-point game. The assist totals, Kevin, just continue to grow. They're way ahead in that category. Ball movement has been flawless. And that one's good. Moran. Well, you can see it's a matter of pride out there for these guys. Not always the best scenario, but in this game, pride takes over. You score on me, I'm going to come back and score on you. Lillard from outside. And the Trailblazers, another three. Yeah, that's two straight three-pointers they've allowed. For the three. And again for... The three. Buries his 10th triple of the game. Unbelievable. And that's one way to end up in the highlights. Yeah, well, the, the bloopers, right? He clangs that one off the back iron, and down it falls. 
Moran's got 47 points. Time called here. The Blazers decide to talk it over. You have to like what you're seeing from John Morant. Not sure what the defense is thinking or if they are. They continue to let him shoot. That is bad defense. Kyle Anderson, he's checked in for Jerem Jackson. Johnson, he's checked in for Portland. And we're just about a minute and a half into the third quarter of basketball. Nurkic finds Lillard. A three ball. Nurkic trying to get open. And Lillard gets it to go. Three points. Lillard's got 12 now in this quarter. And this is what you're going to get with Lillard. He's a gunner. And right now, he's gunning from deep range. And out of bounds as the Trailblazers gain possession. That is just a careless turnover. You've got to be smarter in those exchanges. And Memphis making a change here. Melton's checked in. And it's Lillard with the ball. He brings it up for the Portland Trailblazers. The lead is two. Now, here's Morant for three. Sinks the three-pointer. Morant's got 50 points. He is at his best when it matters most. This game is theirs as long as he can keep this up. Here's Hart. That three off the mark. Memphis has gotten the three ball working for them in the second half. They've hit three out of three shots in long range. I mean, this guy is unreal. What a show. Trailblazers trail by four. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on John Morant. That is his first foul of the game. And the Trailblazers making a change here. Ellaby's checked in. CJ Just under two and a half minutes into the third quarter now. Nurkic kicks to Hart. But three. Trills the three-pointer. Hart's got nine. You can't afford to let Hart get going from deep. He's ready to shoot it when given the opportunity. One place we've really gotten used to seeing Josh Hart make an impact is on the glass. You know what's huge about that, Kevin, is a guard willing to go in and get rebounds just ignites the fast break. I know there are big guys that bust out, but when a guard does it, he gets up to speed and is surveying the floor, and that's where Josh Hart becomes one of those guys that has tremendous value in starting your fast break. That's a two from Lillard. From the top of the key, he buries it. Lillard's got 29. Not just the accuracy in the quarter, it's his movement and the energy that's getting him on this nice roll. Got that one up and quick. He's played a huge role in this game to this point, but it looks like he just wants more. He wants to make sure that this lead holds up. Pass to Lillard. We've gone about three and a half minutes into the third now. Here's Ellaby. Here's Nurkic. Fouled on the shot. Picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. And Nurkic does a great job just keeping the motor running. Clark has checked in for Memphis. Tyus. Jones comes in for Morant. Little. He's checked in for the Trailblazers. And the injury troubles for Yusuf Nurkic. the last few seasons, Brent. My goodness. Freak injuries, too. Just bad luck. I feel like we've said that about the Blazers for about 30 years. Uh, and for Nurkic especially. Just the broken leg, broken wrist. And, you know, when he was in the lineup last year, Kevin, they were, they were one of the best defensive starting fives in the game. Uh, with him being out, they suffered. Let's hope he has good health for the rest of his career. And Brooks, here we go. Clark trying to get open. And the quickness of Brooks's drive can be overwhelming. Burst inside before the D can react. Now the pass to Hart. 129 left in the third quarter of the game. And Kyle Anderson gets the whistle that time. That is his first foul of the game. I mean, I like the call. I thought the defense was just there a little late. And some changes here for the Grizzlies. Jaron Jackson, he's checked in for Kyle Anderson. Williams comes in for Dylan Brooks. And Concha is subbed in for DeAnthony Melton. And the Trailblazers making a change here as well. Justice Winslow, he's checked in for Newark. 